So this is our Gypsy G13BB MPFI engine. So this is the oil filler cap and here we have the oil dipstick and this is our oil filter. So together with the oil change we can also clean the air filter. Air filter you can clean every 5000 kilometers also that will be better if you are uh, running your vehicle at a very dusty conditions. So first we will remove the oil filler cap and keep it open. Now we can remove the oil drain nut. So this is our engine oil sum, here you can see the engine oil drain nut. To remove this one we need a 17 mm socket spanner and then we can drain the oil. So now we can remove the engine oil filter. To remove the engine oil filter you will need the help of an oil filter wrench. So this is available in almost all the automotive tool shop. You can buy this wrench and you can remove the engine oil filter. So clean the surface thoroughly with a good cotton waste and then we can prepare to install the new oil filter. So now we can install the new engine oil filter. This is a Maruti genuine part, you can see the part number as well 16510M73070. It is available at all MGP outlets or you can order it online through sites like Bootmo. Now I will show you the filter. So before applying any new spin on filter you need to apply oil on the o-ring so that when you are screwing it onto the provision you will not damage the o-ring. So make sure to apply some oil before you install it in position. Tighten the filter until the o-ring touches the surface. You do only hand tight until then and after that use a wrench and tighten it 3 quarter turns. That's all. Now it seems the oil has been drained completely, so now we can fix the oil drain nut. This was the old crush washer which was there, it is a copper washer, it, we can use copper washer or aluminum washer, the new one which we purchased is aluminum, we can put the aluminum washer and you can apply Teflon tape as well. So the oil has been drained completely, now we can install the oil drain nut.
normally 20 to 25 Newton meter is a torque that you need to apply on the drain nut. If you do not have a torque wrench, just make it proper hand tight. Do not over tighten it or you will damage the threads. high, low. So, we have filled 4.2 liters now. So, now we can remove the funnel and everything and check the oil level with dipstick and then we can start the engine and see. So, now the oil level is showing at the high or maximum level. We have filled only 4.2 liters as per the owner's manual. Before finalizing, let us start the engine, run it for some time, check for leaks and then wait for a cool down period and then check the oil level again. If required, top it up. <laughs> 